Hi everybody, so today I'm going to be doing another tutorial. Now, I do want to mention a couple things really quickly. One, I did get my nose pierced yesterday, so it is still really raw, it's still new, it's still healing, so I'm not really planning on wearing a bunch of foundation that may, you know, get into it and cause an infection, so I am planning on at least minimum two to three weeks not wearing anything on my face other than maybe concealer underneath my eye, and then I will go into maybe wearing a very light foundation, tinted moisturizer, something like that, and, you know, keep it just on the surrounding area um, but until then I still want to be able to do tutorials so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna zoom you guys in really close like I used to do and then hopefully what I'll do is I'll just you know conceal any areas that may have discoloration that are just around my eyes so that you know it doesn't bother you all too much and you guys get to still see tutorials so I hope you guys will be okay with the way that that's gonna go um, if you do want to see tutorials you know maybe I could just go in and spot conceal my face um, so if you want to see full face tutorials then just let me know and I will try to get some in the next week or so just you know I still want to give it time to heal um so yeah that's pretty much it I will zoom in now and I'll get on with the tutorial okay so to start off this look I already applied a bronzy gold onto my lid now I'm gonna take a damp shader brush and I'm gonna take this color right here which is more of a bronzy base gold and the way I'm going to do that is pick up this color and apply it right on top of that lid color we have already I'm picking up the Real Techniques Base Shadow Brush, and this is a synthetic dupe for the MAC 217 brush, or the Sigma um, E25, I believe. And I'm just going to take a very light taupey brown color, and I'm just going to first pick up that color onto the brush and apply this straight into my crease just to act as a transition color. Picking up this cranberry color right here onto that same brush and I'm going to work this here on the outer corner as well as buff this up into my crease. Make sure that you really buff out any harsh edges because you want this look to be very soft. Lastly, for some added definition, I'm going into this deep charcoal brown and I'm just going to apply this straight into the outer corner of my eye. And then take a matte creamy color and I'm just going to pick this up onto that same brush. I just wiped it off and I'm going to run this right underneath my brow. Do the same thing with a shimmery white color and the inner tear duct of your eye. And with that same cranberry color, you want to run this right along your lower lash line. And make sure you buff it out really well. And that's it for this look. I went ahead and applied a bit of liquid liner to my upper lash line and a bit of mascara. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Don't forget, I will have a list of all my social network usernames in the bottom bar below. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye, everybody.